The concept of T10 actually came up when I was watching a game of soccer. The intensity of sport, the reactions of the crowd, they were really connected to the game. Then I was thinking, okay, if cricket can be brought to 90 minutes and to 10 hours, and that would be, you know, a new format that we could actually do at a commercial level. So that's how the T10 actually was born. I sent something like 16 WhatsApp messages, just to tease us to who the business houses who thought to be interested in cricket. And I got nine confirmations that I was selling only six teams. The belief in T10 was so strong from all quarters. When I actually came to execution, the crowds just uh, amazed us. We had 15, 16,000 people inside. We had 10,000 people standing outside. We had Sharjah police running down to us every half an hour saying we're taking control of the stadium. So I think the biggest challenge was the crowd managing because we did not expect so many crowds, so much, so many people coming and showing up for every day of the format. When I know in a few moments the game will start and I could see the stadium packed, all the players, all the 16 players on the ground, that moment when I declared the game's open would remain as one of my most special moments ever. Chair, Chairman Shaji, Oi Malik and President Salman Iqbal for their vision. Their T10 Cricket League is destined for great results. Shair ne kya khub kaha hai ke ye tezi se bhi tez hai aur tuk tuk se parhez hai. Titan bahut ek acha cricket tournament hoga aur mujhe ummeed hai ke saare world ko ye pasand aayega. The world's first ever international T10 cricket tournament in the world. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the moment which I'm sure will go in the history of the cricket world for years. Let the games begin! The best thing was the crowd, the best thing was the audience around the world accepted the format so well that we had a humongous amount of viewership around the world. We did not know that the whole format will change the cricket history for years to come. Uh, T10 has uh, a global future because in a game to be sustainable it has to make money for people. For the next two teams at almost uh, double or triple the price of our first edition. The team owners, the franchises have already made money. And uh, their confidence in this T10 league is a testimony of, uh, you know, the uh, proof of concept, basically.